Bro, what is this guy's RNG? Holy shit. Oh, at least he's staying because he thinks he's winning. Yeah, true. Oh, big hit. Another big hit. Oh, if you had Karasi, he's fucking dead. Oh my god. Oh, you do have Karasi. I do have Karasi. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> hey, Panic, do you want to NH stake my friend? Absolutely. He's geared. Alright, uh, sounds good. Let's have a look at this loot first. 30 million GP. Thank you very much. All right, tell them to come to World 570. All right, lads, we're going to pause the video real quick as I'm very excited to announce the sponsor for today's video, Clash of Clans. Now, I've played this game for so long now, and if you don't know what Clash of Clans is, have you been living under a rock? It's only one of the best free mobile games to ever exist. So if you don't know what it is, let me give you a quick rundown. Clash of Clans is set in a fantasy-themed world where you can become the chief of your own village. From there, you can use resources gained from attacking other players' villages with your troops to start building and upgrading your own base. Now simply put, there is so much you can do. And you want to make sure that when you are attacking, make sure it is strategic. Right now I'm using the drag strategy, which is one of the more simpler attack styles. It always gets me a three star on any village base I verse. And also as you attack and win more, you will start to earn trophies. And the more trophies you earn, the higher ranked you get. Right now I'm in goal two. I'm aiming to get into crystal because it lets you attack higher level bases, which usually is more rewarding. You can even join up into a clan. It can be super helpful joining a clan from giving you strategic tips to filling your clan castle with higher level troops than yours. My clan is always participating in special events and in the wars against other clans. Now to be participating in these events is very rewarding for your own village so I highly recommend joining a clan. Also not only do you have one village to look after but you can have two. The content in the game is honestly just endless and I love it. In fact there's much more in the game that we've talked about today. I've just covered like the base of it but you have to find the rest out for yourself. If you aren't convinced already please go download the game right now for free by going into the description down below or scanning the queue our code right here. You will not regret it. All right, 100 mil on the line. I haven't NA staked in a long time, so I feel like I'm just gonna lose it. But we'll see what happens. Nice, we tanked the bolt. Mage me. Thank you. Ah, lucky freeze RNG. He's not specking me there. We get his robes there, that's huge. Refreeze. It's my freeze RNG. Did he just emote? I think I'm just saying shit, bro. No, he's, he's emoting. Why are you emoting? Oh my. But on robes is zero. Bro, he's done like 130 damage in like, what, seven hits or something? And he hasn't even specced. Nah, I should have specced there. Well, that's a fast bolt. Another one. Bolt on robes. Ah, I missed the prayer though. Alright, we're gonna refreeze. Let's just chill for a second, think what he's gonna do. Does he like to- Yeah, okay, he likes to bolt on the corners. Free hit here, may as well take advantage of it. And he bolts on one tick as well. There we go, so we can bolt underneath him. And there we go, hit his robes. Okay, so I just have to like one tick underneath him. He defends like, kind of like most people defend. Oh, bolted his robes, he fucked up. Let's focus on defense. Bro, that mage was so good of me. Perfect refreeze timing as well. That was actually a really nice mage by him. This guy's switches are insane. And he's emoting me. What is happening? What is this fight? Free hit. Bro, the, <laughs> the emotes are messing me up. I need to focus. I'm like bringing it back. But I'm up heaps on tracker, so that's what matters. Refreeze, please. But our RNG is not going our way. Nice refreeze. Fuck it. Ah, Starfish, I can't click. Bro, the, I swear to god, this emoting is messing me up. Predicted that prayer. I don't even know if I prayed it correctly there. Predicted that spec. Oh, it's not a refreeze. Ah, shit, he just fucked me with that claw spec. Refreeze? Ah, delay. I'm like one tick behind on my food. Ah, I fucked that up so bad. Yeah, you got heaps of free hits there. We're still up on tracker. It's always winnable. Let's chill for a sec and think what we're gonna do. Spec. Oh, I wasn't wasn't 50. Absorb the bolt, free hit. Just keep it simple. I right, we really need this refreeze. If I'm gonna win. Yes, sir. That's what we like to see. I was supposed to corner there. He 
He's still emoting, bro. This guy's nuts. Oh, my bot didn't go off. Probably should have warmed up beforehand. Nice splash. Sick kid. Come on, refreeze. I need as many freezes as I can get. Ah, oh, crap. This is not good. I'm out of food. He's not, like, praying mage ever. Like, he's rarely praying mage. So I think I'm just going to prioritize mage. Right, we're out of food. We're not that far behind. Like, we're plus 90 on tracker. As if that's not a refreeze. Come on, refreeze, refreeze. Yes, sir. Oh, no, we, he got the freeze as well. He's still emoting. How is he still emo emoting, bro? This is for 100 mil. Big blood barrages. He's starting to pray mage. Picking up on it, but I don't really have a choice. Throwing a weird whip. Catch him off guard. Oh. GG. Oh my. What a comeback. Holy shit. That guy was really good. Actually, he was very, very good. His switches and one ticks were on point. Holy shit. That was a bot? Wait, no way that was a bot. That was... That felt like I was versing a human. Like, it didn't even have auto prayers, did it? Holy shit. Look at this. I've never seen a bot react to like my overheads like this. And you can see he's moving around at the same time. So it looks like it's like a human and a bot at the same time, but like a really complex bot. Like I was in H it, but it felt like a person. It didn't feel like a bot at all. Again, for another 100 mil. I mean, we can. I, I did beat it, but like, you know, quite a bit. Like now I know that it's a bot, so I should just beat it by more, right? All right, round two against the OP freaking PVP bot. I'm definitely going to make a video on this. This is... Okay, so it looks like if I just like one tick my prayers, it does the opposite. So I just have to like keep my prayers one ticking. And then it will always do the opposite sort of thing. Like Inferno, you know? The tricky part... Is doing it... <laughs> is doing it and not missing any switches myself. When I'm like... Super rusty, because I haven't done this in so long. Is that on robes? Okay, I think I figured out how to hit it on robes. I'll try again in a second. Let me just get a refreeze and then we'll go for it. Ah, freeze each other. That's okay, I think being frozen away from it is... Get the rhythm going. Yeah, I think being frozen away from it is good because I can pray it pretty much every time. As long as I don't fuck up. Because I just have to like one tick switch between prayers, you know? Yeah, I predicted it's spec there. I think it's a player who's going for like spec timing and stuff. But then the bot's doing all the automatic stuff. Yeah, so see that I can't pray range and I flick to pray mage on the dangerous tick. And that way I can hit its robes, like when it wants to mage me, like here. Okay, it's prioritizing tank. That's really cool. Yep, there again. Skip a tick and then bolt. Yep, okay, so I figured out how to hit its robes. Get a refreeze, please. Ah, oh, I got my timer fucked up. Got it now. Can I react? Defending against this thing, like defending DD against this thing is really freaking hard though. That's for sure. Okay, you know what? I think I defended that quite well, considering. Altered it on its robes as well. Whip on robes. Okay, I think the first whip on robes didn't hit his robe just because it was eating. Skip a tick in and hit robes. Yeah. Yeah, watch carefully guys. I'm not going to say anything, just watch how I'm hitting the ropes, like the prayer timing. And how I'm like... I missed that one because he walked under me. But you see what I mean? Like I just have to time his attacks and swap the prayer relative to his cooldown. That kind of makes sense. It's a lot easier to do when I'm like DDing him than when I'm getting DD'd. 
Yeah, I feel like to defend correctly, even though you know what's a bot, you have to be really fast. Like if this versus the average player, or even a really good player that just isn't fast enough, like with their clicks, it's gonna, um... Is it saying tick me? Okay, it does. Um, yeah, it's just gonna fuck it up. I think all of my specs have been off prayer, so I don't think you can really detect one, um, one tick specs. GG. Yeah, like plus 200 on tracker there as well. So I did a few more fights against the bot and ended up speaking to the owner of the bot and he's never unleashed it on PvP, thankfully. And he never plans to. His goals are just to um, just have fun coding and build something unique, which I can respect. But at the same time, I do see the potential for this to enter PvP and completely destroy everyone. Um, I don't know, let me know in the comments down below what should Jagex do about bots like this? Because bots are <laughs> they're moving forwards as you can see. But anyways guys, that is it for the vid. I'll see you all tomorrow.